So I was hired about five years ago. I was the second Protestant to be on staff at um, the office that functions as campus ministry on campus. I walked in on my first day and there were 10 students who weren't Catholic who were trying to figure out what ministry and community would look like on campus. And so we started a sort of experiment at the end of an academic year. We took the last six weeks and said, well, let's try worshiping every week. But by week two or three, they had decided they were all in and we've been worshiping every Sunday since. Coming here, I really felt like I had the opportunity to explore things, to think about what I really believe. As I finished my first semester here, I definitely doubted God. And so then when I started going to Common Ground, I saw that there was more like wiggle room, I should say. And that really challenged me to think like all the big questions, like why do good things happen to bad people? And like, was Jesus sent to die on the cross? And if he was, what does that say about God? They like to call it church mostly. And they have great debates about that because some of them say, in fact, no, we're, we're a church. We're just a church. That's all we are. And they get empowered by thinking about they're a church. And then there are other students who feel more comfortable with the mostly part. They like the mostly part because the church part still feels a little intimidating or scary. Basically, they're a church. We do sacraments. We had a baptism this year. Um, we preach, we sing, we, we pray, we do the very churchy things together. No different than the neighborhood church, it's just that our neighborhood happens to be a Jesuit campus of 4,000 students. So it's really just been a place for me to have family and a community of people who um, support me and are able to help me with my walk um, with Christ throughout my four years at Xavier. And it's, it's super important to have that, so. Common Ground is my family, my best friends, people who've watched me grow through these four years. Common Ground is a place where I can really be Allison. The gracious part of that for me has been Common Ground being my home. Even though it's not my college experience, it's the students who sometimes are my pastor because they challenge me theologically. Honestly, when I came in as a freshman, I was, I was really like on the borderline of like my faith life and things like that. And if it wasn't for like Abby or it's, honestly, if it wasn't for Abby, I probably wouldn't be, I guess, a Christian today. So much more is available to us when we answer that call of Christ to take care of each other, to live as if we belong to each other, to be each other's brothers and sisters.